If you haven't seen Spider-Man Homecoming yet, and that you don't want any unspoiled, then I suggest you leave right now. Granted, I haven't seen the film yet, seen as it's not yet out at the time of this recording, but seen as this is a minor spoiler, I thought, you know what, fuck it, let's discuss this. Now, Spider-Man Homecoming is about to be released in a matter of days, and unsurprisingly, a bunch of spoilers have recently surfaced online. And don't worry, I'm not going to be touching upon anything major within the film, but apart from a mysterious character within the film. Now, everyone knew for a very long time that Zendaya was cast within the film. However, her role remained a mystery for a very long time. Which led to a bunch of people theorising that Zendaya will in fact play Mary Jane Watson. Which also led to a bunch of controversy in which I am not going to be touching upon. And for a very long time until the film came out, she was referred as Michelle. However, near the end of the film, it is revealed that Zendaya's character is actually named Michelle Jones. However, she simply said, says, just call me MJ, as to which everyone knows is indeed a nod to Mary Jane Watson, and perhaps also a little jab at the rumours. Now ever since that revelation, a lot of people have been theorising that Zendaya's character Michelle Jones will in fact be the Mary Jane of the MCU. However, honestly, I don't think that this is going to be the case, and the whole MJ thing is nothing more but a little nod, while Michelle Jones will remain as her original character. And I've seen a lot of videos in which covers this revelation, of a lot of people keep skimming over the simple facts. And just because her nickname is MJ, doesn't mean that she is in fact going to be Mary Jane Watson. Because like I said, her real name is in fact Michelle Jones. And if you look at her initials, it is in fact MJ. And again, nothing more but a nice little nod. And I'm not here to slander this actress by any stretch. In fact, if Marvel Studios decided to turn her character into the new Mary Jane Watson, then I think that Zendaya would portray a very interesting take on the character. However, I do believe that everyone is overthinking this, and I do believe that she is not in fact the true Mary Jane. And seeing as how the MCU always likes to play with their characters, I wouldn't necessarily say rule this possibility out entirely, because this is still possible. And also the reason why I don't believe that Zendaya will in fact be the new Mary Jane Watson is because already Already we have Liz Allen who is going to be the love interest for Peter Parker in Spider-Man Homecoming. And already they are actually planting the seeds for Gwen Stacy for future installments, seeing as how she was accidentally leaked. And if we were to follow in the order of all the major love interests that Peter Parker had over the years, then Mary Jane would be the third. And if we were to get the introduction of Mary Jane Watson in the MCU, then I believe that she won't make an appearance until, at the very least, the third instalment, or at the very least, the second trilogy of Spider-Man films. Which is a bit of a stretch, confirmed that he will have a second sequel, but seeing as how Tom Holland is actually game in becoming Spider-Man for a very long time, and also that Spider-Man is a big bank, it is almost a guarantee. So how do you feel about the whole MJ thing? Do you believe that Michelle Jones will in fact be the MCU's Mary Jane Watson? Or do you believe that we're not going to get a proper introduction to Mary Jane Watson till another instalment? Comment below and share some thoughts. And as always, thank you guys for watching this video. Please like and subscribe, take care and have a good one.